From farm fields to electric dreams, the untold story of Wong Chuan Fu, the battery king and chairman of BYD. Born in a dusty hamlet in Anhui, China, amidst rice paddies and bamboo whispers, young Chuan Fu knew hardships bite early. Orphaned as a teenager, he found solace in books and the glint of possibility in science. With his brother's worn hand on his shoulder and his sister's rice pudding filling his belly, Chuan Fu clawed his way out of poverty, one equation at a time. College, once a shimmering mirage, became a reality as he sweated one equation at a time, transforming the mirage of college into a hard-won reality. University life for Chuan Fu was a symphony of clanging beakers and sizzling Bunsen burners. He dived headfirst into the world of batteries, their hidden energies whispering secrets his mind devoured. Soon, with a master's degree clutched in his calloused hands, he landed a cushy government job, the envy of his village. But Chuan Fu was no desk drone. The entrepreneurial itch tickled under his skin like a runaway electron. In 1995, the 29-year-old Chuan Fu, along with his cousin Lu Qing Yang, took a leap of faith that could have landed them face first in a puddle of battery acid. BYD, born in a Shenzhen garage, which by the way stands for Build Your Dreams, sputtered to life. Their first product? Nickel cadmium batteries, the cranky granddaddies of the modern cell. But these weren't your grandma's leaky batteries. Ron Fu's creations were built like miniature tanks, powering everything from walkie-talkies to, soon enough, Nokia phones. BYD became the energizer bunny of the tech world, its batteries hopping out of every gadget imaginable. In 2003, Wong made a bold move by acquiring Chin One Auto Company, marking BYD's entry into the automobile industry. This decision was driven by his vision of combining BYD's expertise in battery technology with automotive production to create affordable and eco-friendly electric vehicles. Under Wong's leadership, BYD expanded rapidly in the EV market. The company developed a range of electric cars, buses, and trucks, along with energy storage solutions. BYD's innovations in iron phosphate batteries and other technologies have positioned it as a major player in the global push toward sustainable transportation. Success, however, tasted bittersweet. Guan Fu, the shy scientist, was thrust into the limelight, squirming under suits and boardroom jargon. He fumbled with investor chopsticks, tripped over PowerPoint presentations, and once, memorably, addressed a crowd of CEOs as fellow nerds. But under the awkward exterior, a steely resolve simmered. Chuan Fu would not be bullied by fancy suits or PowerPoint dragons. He had a vision, a green and electric one, and he would not be swayed. That vision? Electric cars. When everyone scoffed, calling them golf carts for rich hippies, Chan Fu simply smiled. He poured his battery mastery into sleek, silent vehicles defying skeptics with every whir of the electric engine. BYD cars, once laughed at, became the toast of the automotive world, outselling Tesla and claiming the crown of the world's largest EV maker. Ron Fu, the farm boy turned battery king, remains a humble hero. He still visits his village, not in a limo, but on a trusty BYD e-bike, sharing rice pudding and wisdom with the next generation of dreamers. His story is a testament to the power of grit, of defying odds, with a good dose of science and a sprinkling of nerdiness. He's proof that even the dimmest village light can flicker into a beacon, illuminating the path toward a greener electric future. The tables have turned, folks, and the once unassailable king of electric car jungle, Tesla, has been dethroned. In a stunning upset, BYD, the scrappy upstart from China, 
has roared past Elon Musk's shiny chariots to claim the crown of the world's best-selling EV manufacturer. It's like David, armed with a slingshot of lithium-ion batteries, taking down Goliath. Remember BYD, the battery whizzes who used to power your Nokia back in the day. Well, they've been quietly brewing a storm, churning out EVs like nobody's business. While Tesla was busy perfecting its autopilot and launching cars into space, BYD was out there, hustling in the trenches, building affordable, reliable electric cars for the masses. They're like the Energizer Bunny of the EV world, just keep going, going, and going, leaving a trail of zero emission dust in their wake. It's a sweet victory for BYD, a testament to their relentless innovation and dedication to making EVs accessible to everyone. Though so next time you see a sleek BYD zipping past, give it a honk of respect. The electric revolution is in full swing and BYD at this point is leading the charge. One battery powered dream at a time.